Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So currently in the stable version of Microsoft Edge, if we right click and add tab to new group, we currently get default set colors that you cannot change in the browser. So you can choose any of these different colors, but you don't have the ability to change these default colors to apply to a given tab group. Now this could all be set to change because in Edge Canary, if we just pop over to the early preview version, which is currently sitting on version 135, you can now apply a custom color to your tab groups. So if we do the same, we right click on a tab, add tab to new group. You can see here that over and above the default colors that are available in the stable version of Edge, we now get a custom color where you can use a color picker to choose your desired color, which I actually think is quite nice, especially if you are using tab groups in the actual Edge browser. So if we just move the slider, we can head to a color. We have our recent colors here in these little thumbnails. And yeah, we can just slide this around to choose our desired color. And we click on apply and you can see there's my custom color. Let me just do that one more time. Let's right click, add tab to new group, new group, color picker. Let's go this way. You get the idea and you can choose your desired color. Click on apply. And I think this is a nice move, especially if you have a lot of tab groups, you can kind of identify them now with a lot more colors, not just the default. Now, this is hidden behind an experimental flag in Edge Canary 135. So if we head into our experimental flags page and we just type tab. Yeah, you can see custom colors for tab groups. If enabled, users can set their own custom colors for tab groups in the tab strip and I've enabled that. So it's not a default feature yet in Edge Canary. It's hidden behind an experimental flag. So at this stage, not known if this will actually make its way into the stable version. But I don't see why it wouldn't. I actually think this brings a nice dynamic to your tab groups and gives you a lot more sort of customization options. So obviously I keep my eye on this. And even when it does make its way to stable, I'll try and let you guys know. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.